Well, I made a promise. Uh, I was going to start a YouTube channel for my new marketing agency. Uh, by the way, my name is Chris Putnam, and I am the founder and owner of Hook and Reel. And I don't always look like this. I am scruffy, as you can see. I have bags underneath my eyes. My hair is a mess. I have a horrible outfit on. I'm a little stinky. Um, and I wanted to make this video because I'm starting an agency and... You know, it's so polished, everything. Um, social media, call to actions, get it better, get the pixel right. Um, wear the right shirt, make sure it's tailored and make sure you're clean. And we put this facade out when really I wanted to, for pos posterity purposes, <laughs> um, to make a video to remind myself of what it is really to be an entrepreneur and it is long hours and I've been staying up to like three in the morning and I just wanted to tell everybody my story before I put out all the polished material because I want everybody to know who I am um, and I'm just like you I'm an entrepreneur that believes in capitalism proper capitalism um, all ships rise on a high tide and I want to remind myself and I want to remind my viewers because I intend to scale my agency and to help as many brands as humanly possible. My name is Chris Putnam, owner and founder of Hook and Reel. I have 25 years experience in sales and marketing and I've hit a lot of home runs. I've hit a lot of glory and slams. I've had a few bunts in there too. I can't say I've ever completely failed. Um, I've had modest successes, 10, 20% gains annually. Um, but for the most part, I've, I've done well in sales, sales and marketing. It's not that I'm smarter than anyone. I think everybody has their calling and I found mine. As you get to know me, I love talking and I um, love connecting with people. I'm a people person. So I wanted everybody to hear my story. I'm just holding my phone. There's no tripod. I'm in my office and I just put my YouTube channel up. Check this out. It's probably not going to be very good, but you can check it out. And I've been working my buns off. I got my Vimeo set up, Facebook, Instagram, been doing a lot of posting. Starting out, sub 100 followers. I love it. I love it. Um, you know, I was listening to Alex. Um, I think anybody that is going to be following me knows who I'm talking about. What an inspiration. Uh, Gary Vee is another one that I love. But he really has been saying something that's like hitting home with me. It is not about you know, where we're going to end up or the money or the clients and all of that. It is really about you better love what you're doing. And I love it. I was up till three in the morning. I've been up till three in the morning for a lot of nights building my own website. I've always hired people to do websites and I've always stood over their shoulder and said, Hey man, can you do this? Can you do that? And now it's like, I'm sitting over my shoulder saying, Hey Chris, do that. Then I'm YouTubing things, messing with it, failing with it, padding margins, even putting up the YouTube video uh, or the banner is you have to go into Canva and keep editing it and keep editing it until it looks right. So I want for everybody out there that's starting a business, we're all in this, you know, it's tough. And there is a segment of people out in the world that look at business owners and people that make something of themselves as bad or that they had it handed to them. And I'm sure there's a few of them. It's a lot of work. It's a lot of late nights. It's a lot of sacrifice. And it's so worth it. Um, I, I can't wait to help. I've helped a lot of companies. Um, and now I'm going to build my own and still help companies. Um, and I'm going to do it on my way. But it was funny. I was talking to Grant, who's going to be on my board of directors. And... You know, that's part of the reason I got let go from my last job. It wasn't performance because I perform. I think I grew their B2B 1200% in 18 months, top line revenue 250% in 18 months. All the KPIs were great. Um, but I couldn't play nice, you know? My ego got in the way and that's the number one thing I want everybody to hold me to as well as you know, just holding myself to it is make sure you play nice. 
but a little bit on myself. I'm going to get away from my office. I think they say in social media, you're supposed to move around. Um, this is, that was my office and this is my bedroom. And I really wanted to show you guys this empty coffee sitting there. My clothes are wrecked. Jordan Peterson would be so mad at me. My bed is not made. I usually always make my bed. Look at my dirty shirt. If you can smell me right now, I'm super stinky. I'm doing this towel on the ground. Look, I'm going to take you around my house. You can kind of see this. That's my son right there. See, check it out. That was when he was a little baby. But I wanted to do this for a reminder for myself and for everybody out in social media land that this is real you know this is what it is starting a business and it isn't lamborghinis and private jets it is messy kitchens just made steak it is it is normal life not this facade that we put out there it is real people helping real people and i want everybody to remember that works with me and i want to remind myself it's not about the money it is about doing good for people. My name is Chris Putnam, owner and founder of Hook and Reel. And I would love to get to know all of you guys. If you have any questions, I'm going to do a follow-up video um, where you learn a little bit about me. And the cool thing will be, you will see it get really polished really quick. But I wanted my first video for Hook and Reel to be this, to be real. You're going to hear about my successes, how I've grown companies 1,200% three times over in 18 months. So I have a pedigree of growing companies and marketing them and all that good stuff. But I wanted you to see the lifelong cubicle guy that started his own agency to build something for himself while helping others. I wanted you to see the very beginning of it and follow me on my journey. My name is Chris Putnam and I love you guys.